In 1996, a European company introduced the first ever whole body vibration machine to market. It produced pivotal vibration, otherwise known as side alternating, rotational or oscillating. Two years later, another European company introduced to market another type of whole body vibration machine. It produced lineal vibration, otherwise known as vertical, synchronous or triplanar. Despite using different methods, both types of machines were built on the principle of increasing the gravitational force, or g-force, acting on our body. By accelerating our body upwards on a platform against the acceleration of Earth's gravity, which is pulling us downwards, increased loading is placed onto our muscles and bones. This increased loading on our bodies stimulates muscle and bone growth, weight loss, and many other benefits. About a decade after the original European machines were released, Asian manufacturers started producing vibration machines too, but it would seem that some of them have not understood the concept. The latest innovation from Asia is spiral vibration. In a traditional vibration machine, the force of gravity is primarily directed vertically up through the body. In a spiral vibration machine, the vibration is not directed into the body at all. Instead, the G-force is mostly directed horizontally away from the body. Spiral machines are often capable of a dual mode vibration, where spiral vibration plus pivotal vibration operates at the same time. It sounds like a great feature, however, even with the addition of some pivotal vibration, these machines are not able to produce the same levels of upward g-force that the scientifically proven machines can. In a Canadian study, scientists took a machine that had three different vibration modes, pivotal mode, spiral mode, and dual vibration mode with pivotal and spiral vibration together. The scientists found that the horizontal g-force produced by the spiral vibration did not cause any increased muscle activity at all. And it was only the upward g-force produced by the pivotal vibration that increased muscle activity, but only when it was more than two g's. The scientists also noted that their study had limitations due to the relatively low pivotal capabilities of the spiral machine and recommended that trainers and therapists should advise their clients to exercise on pivotal or lineal platforms where spiral vibration did not seem to be necessary. There are hundreds of studies showing the benefits of whole body vibration. None of those studies use spiral or dual mode vibration to achieve those benefits. There is no scientific support. The key to whole body vibration is the upward g-force produced by a platform. Our engineers at Hypervibe have designed each of our machines to produce at least 10 g's of acceleration in the upward direction which is the direction scientists have shown provides maximum benefits.